Hi, welcome to the channel of Budget Audio Review and Upgrades. Now if this is out of sync with me talking, doesn't matter. We're going to see how loud this actual valve amplifier goes. This Chinese made valve amplifier. And before I start, I just want to say a couple of things really. First of all, thanks for all the new subscribers. You know, coming on board, helping me, giving me motivation to keep putting these videos out. And hopefully somewhere along the line, I'm helping someone somewhere. It may not be everyone's taste, that's for certain. Obviously, I go on YouTube and look at other people's videos, and there's a chap I follow on there, it's very helpful. Uh, means these receivers, I'm not going to say who it is, but you know, a few of you may have an idea who it is anyway. And he's had a couple of negative comments there, people saying that he's putting this, he's monetizing his videos like myself. And I think he had a three or four minute video, and someone said, you know, that's out of order, monetizing that four and a half minute video. Now, if he doesn't monetize it, I'm afraid YouTube will. It's just the way it is now. You don't have to have a thousand subscribers anymore. YouTube now are going to monetize any video they want if you're not doing the partnership program with them. So if he's not monetizing it, YouTube will. Now, I'm not saying this is wrong. YouTube's got all their files and everything on their servers, all cost money. They're there to make a profit as also. And of course, we're doing this also as a bit of fun. We're doing it a bit of fun because we're not earning any fortunes out of it. But every penny we do get is getting, well, in my particular case, is getting reinvested in other stuff so I can bring it to the channel. And hopefully somewhere along the line, I'm going to dig out something that you may be interested in and give you my opinion. And hopefully that's going to help you along the way. So, and these, these videos do take a long time. It may seem like just three minutes. It's going to take three minutes to put together your money grabbing or something like that. This is not the case, I can assure you. Some three minute videos or four minute videos take two days to film. You know, it's unbelievable really, dragging the stuff down, getting it in position, cut, edit, all that kind of stuff. So just bear that in mind, you know what I mean? I'm just saying bear that in mind. I'm not sticking up for people really. I'm just saying, you know, it, it, it's not as easy as it looks and hopefully you're getting some entertainment and you're getting some information out of it as well. And I've had a few jobs around the house, sorry this is a bit long-winded, a few jobs around the house where plumbing, you know, that kind of stuff, where I've got no idea whatsoever. I go on YouTube and some fellas put a video up there to show me how to do it, and it's got 10 adverts in a 10-minute video. And it doesn't bother me, because as long as I'm getting the information I want, it doesn't really matter. It's saving me money, and that's what it's all about. You know, good luck to this other bloke if he's earning something out of it. You don't get nothing for nothing these days, and it's helped me out anyway. Anyway, we're going to go back to this now. This amplifier here is well documented, talked about more than myself, but I will dive more into this. I'm gonna start changing the valves. I'm gonna start doing some little tweaks inside. I'm following uh, a YouTuber called uh, Skunky uh, Designs Electronics. I think that's what it is. I'm gonna leave a link down below anyway. And this YouTuber actually knows a lot, 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 lot more about these valve amplifiers than me. That's for certain. I'm a complete newbie with valves. You know what I mean? I'm a complete newbie. Right. This is supposed to be 6.8 watts a channel, I think it is, something like that. And this YouTuber's saying you'd be lucky to get two watts out of it somewhere around there. And once you go above one watt, it's gonna get quite distorted as well. But there is a few little mods we can do to combat that and help it along the way. And that's what I'm gonna be doing in some more up and coming videos. Also, I've got some old amplifiers, mainly Sansui's, but there is a couple of other little makes there as well. They're, they're, you know, when you read the reviews, etc., these are tube-like sounding amplifiers, and I will be putting these against this and seeing how tube they are compared with this. Is this really a tube sound? I don't know. I take it it must be a kind of tube sound, considering there's tubes involved. Uh, so I'm gonna kind of be pitting them against it as well, bringing the results, doing some sound tests, all that. It's all to come. Maybe boring for some people that's not really interested in this, and it's not really what this channel's about. I must admit, I kind of bought this on a whim, and I'm kind of going to stick with it over the period of the channel. Obviously, going to put some other bits of content in between as well. And once we get to the bottom of it, I've done all my videos. This will be put in a comment, and we get back to normal. So just bear with me with that as well. And I'll thank you for bearing with me. Right. Okay. This is just a simple test. We're going to see how loud this goes. I'm not going to crank it all the way up because it will get evidently distorted, as that YouTuber said. So we're going to turn it up, you know, as much as possible. I'll tell you where the volume is, just to give you some idea how loud these can go. And these speakers here, 88 dB, these are more than short, 35 Ti's, 88 dB. So obviously if you get a more sensitive speaker, it's going to be even louder. And this will give you an idea, this room here is three and a half meters wide by seven meters deep. So it gives you an idea of how big this room is. The microphone's about two and a half meters away. I'm going to talk as well as I'm doing it. It's going to drown me out, hopefully, and you'll get an idea, hopefully, of how loud this actually goes. So here we go. We're 
we'll start off low and we're just going to crank it up gradually. I'll get out of the way of the speaker. I'm going to talk as well to give you some kind of idea. I'm talking quite loudly of how loud these go. Hopefully you're going to get some kind of impression of how loud this amplifier actually goes. So just probably about two watts out from that. Driving down this dark road We're halfway, halfway What way, way should I go? The path that leads to the right road Just going to let the record come in It's taking me back home my recording equipment may have distorted but that at the end was three quarters i thought it was at three quarters and i was shouting i wasn't quite just turned it up a couple of more notches it's about three quarters so that gives you an idea of how loud this amplifier can go and give you some kind of idea that you may be thinking this is not going to be powerful enough for you well i think it is uh you know it may not have um, you know the best sound you know distortion wise and all that kind of thing but hopefully we're going to address that uh, with these little mods that this YouTube has uh, put up kindly. So I'm not, no, nothing to do with me, I'm just gonna follow their mods and uh, report back how it, this actually sounds. Now, I've nearly got about 50 or 60 hours worth of use out of this now, so I'm gonna do some little recordings with it as is. It's gonna be quite a lengthy recording, really. Give you an idea if you're looking for this and you're not gonna touch it, you're gonna buy it as is, what it's gonna sound like. Them videos will be coming up shortly with some others as well. All to do with this amplifier. This is the Newbie 6P1. Okay, I'll say thanks for watching and I'll see you all soon.